Hello and good morning, everyone, and thanks for joining us today. I have a special gift that I just got today, and I want to share it with you all. This gift was given to me by someone who I didn't expect to give me a gift, and who I'm pretty sure got the gift from someone else. Are you ready for me to share that gift with you? Are you sure? Well, here it is. Good morning. That was it. That was the big gift that I was so excited to share with you. A big welcoming smile and the message of a good day. And wow, did it make my day. Today, as I was taking my dogs out to use the bathroom, a stranger was walking by and just gave me a big smile and said good morning. I don't think this person came looking for me to deliver this gift, but I do think that that gift was actually a gift from God to remind me that there is kindness and care in the world. It may not seem like much of a gift, but that gift or that smile and good morning is an opportunity for us to appreciate the goodness and love that God gifts us every day, and also an opportunity for us to share that same gift from God with others. Being kind to someone, sharing a hug, even giving someone a meaningful nickname are just some ways that we can share God's gifts in the world. And no one is better in the world if we keep God's gifts just to ourselves. In fact, in today's gospel, we hear about how John the Baptist shared with the world one of God's greatest gifts to us. Do you know what that gift was? Jesus Christ. <laughs> While walking with some of his own disciples, John saw Jesus and instantly knew that Jesus was the promised one to come into the world and remind the world of God's love for all. Instead of keeping that information to himself, he shared it with those around him, saying, Behold the Lamb of God, who takes away the sin of the world. He knew that the world would be a better place if it just knew of Jesus and what he stood for. While we may not have Jesus here in front of us physically to share with the world, we can still share the other gifts of God to the world. The gift of kindness, the gift of understanding, the gift of appreciation, the gift of love. These are just a few examples of where we can find God in today's world interacting with us and how we too can share God's gift with others. Sometimes all it takes is a big smile and a good morning to you to say, I love you and care for you. Will you join me in prayer? Ever giving God, thank you for all that you provide for us in both the big ways and the little ways. Each way is a reminder of your never ending love for us. May we open our eyes, see your gifts and share them with the rest of the world. In your name we pray, amen. Thank you.